What's going on, YouTube? This is NecroStevo, and today I am joined by Astro Ragtime, or Guy, I think he might be preferred to be called. Say hello, sir. I returned as the guest. Indeed. So thank you for joining I me. Like, I'm glad to be here. Awesome. I mean, it's been a while. Too yeah. Long. I think the last time we did something was the Mega Mystery. Yes, it was. And I'm I gotta say, you were right. Your team is weird. <laughs> I wanted to make you guess on which Pokemon I have with Technician, but it's really a 50-50 shot. Speaking of which, would you like to explain what we're doing today? Alright. Today, because I was bored, and when I was bored, I tend to come up with strange ideas. So I came up with this challenge mode I like to call Technicality, in which you are only allowed one Pokemon with the ability Technician, but all of your moves need to be base power 60 or less. So if they don't get the Technician moves, then you're not allowed to use them. And it was just odd because was, I was looking at the team choices for moves base power 60 or less, and I was like, wow, I can't use U-turn. Oh crap, I can't use Volt Switch. Oh man, I can't use Scald. It's uh, <laughs> limiting. Yeah, it's... It's really interesting. It forces you to think about things differently. Um, I also want to point out that I decided to bring Celebi along the same time of you bringing two bug types. So, you know, that was a great decision. <laughs> well, I mean, like, let's see. I've got three potential Mega, two potential um, technician users, and Golurk, because who doesn't like Golurk? Yeah, I like how he flies around in the Pokemon movie where his arms and legs just turn into thrusters. Alright, in Generation 5, as soon as I found out that Golurk could learn fly, just... Nope, sorry Volcarona. <laughs> I got a giant robot. Volcarona was relegated to egg hatching duty. Pretty much. Poor Volcarona. Indeed. All you saw was that one rote... And the little temple where I found you that one time. So, for my viewers, I'm just going to go ahead and spoil who's my technician user now with using this handy dandy mouse that you can't see. And I guess I'll mouse over each of my sets too. I It was fun because um, uh, although technicality means you can't use things with greater than 60 base power, you're still allowed to use things like strong jaw or adaptability. Uh, to increase the power of things, so um, that as kind of as long as the initial number right. is sixty or less, exactly, then it's good to go. Yep, it's just that initial bit there. All right, so are you ready to start this technicality match, sir? I am absolutely ready. Good, because I'm not. I am not ready at all. Um, hmm. Man, I'm sad that you brought Golurk when I brought Porygon Z. That kind of puts a damper on spamming adaptability boosted moves. <laughs> Honestly, I never really liked to use adaptability on my um, Oregon Z. Oregon Z. What do you use? Uh, download? I use download. It's a 50% shot, but... I just don't like um, my boost being reliant on my opponent. Because a lot of builds will be built specifically to give you the wrong boost. Mm. Off to a great start. <laughs> well, let's be generic. Well, don't do that. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Everything's just a little bit bulkier. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Oh, I'm happy I did that. That worked out. That worked out nicely. And I don't get the speed boost because sheer force. I didn't realize Flame Wheel was base 60. Huh? Oh no, I was thinking of, um, Flare. Uh, wow. I was thinking of, um, um, I'm blanking out on what I was thinking of. That's great. Anyways. Let's. Flame Charge. There we go. Good grief. No! Oh, yes! No! Come Yay. on, Golurk. What's your problem? 
You got problems, go work. You got problems. He's a super robot. What do you expect? Mm. We need the theme song. True. I wasn't expecting Protect on Golurk. That's... That's interesting. I don't think you're going to expect most of what I got. True. That's like this. Like Explosion Golurk? No. <laughs> <laughs> Little bit illegal. Just Yay. slightly. Just mostly illegal. Um, um. What can you get away with now? You get your rocks up, I get my rocks up. We'll parlay. Everyone's got rocks. Take this magical leaf, sir. Have you ever seen how Magical Leaf uh, is animated in the series? It follows the opponent around, so Ash is Swallow, I think, at the time. He was fighting Gardenia, and Gardenia's, I think it was Cherubi, used Magical Leaf, and it just follows Swallow flying around the arena. <laughs> 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 and so he, he gets past it by just flying straight up, and it runs out of power. It didn't make any sense. <laughs> he was what? like, get out of range. If we were to go through everything, I think we discussed this last time, if we were to go through everything, that Ash manages to get away with, we would be here forever. This is true. Wow, I did no damage. Basically. No. Oh, you smacked yourself. Wow, I did a lot of damage. Are you banded, sir? I believe that you were banded based on that damage you did to yourself. Uh, I left this open. I don't know. I can't tell you any more secrets. You could. Nothing's. I mean, it's totally not a Oh. Dang. Alrighty then, I'm happy you smacked yourself then. Oh no! No, my speed! So much for reinvesting max speed on Caesar. I've, I've really liked putting max speed on Caesar lately. I don't know, it's been running running like the Swords Dance set with a lot of speed. That's been working out very nicely lately. Why do you even need speed? I don't, just I don't know. I don't, it's just been working out well. Because normally things can just come in and smack them, but after a sword stance, it's like, I don't care if you're normally faster than me, I'm going to bug bite you now. Nom. And bug bite is allowed. And it's also not something I want. Yeah, but it's a good good idea for you to switch. Assuming I went for the bug bite. Well, I might have a thing or two. I can do something or two. Don't get paralyzed. Oh yay, delicious citrus berries. Ah, uh, the way I said that made it sound like testicles, I take it back. <laughs> I'm not actually, I really hope Ampharos isn't your mega, that might be an issue. Hopefully it's pincer, especially with stealth rocks up. Come on, make a pincer. That was a poor choice. Aw oh, man. Well now I know you have hidden power fire at least. Too bad, Darmanitan's dead. Maybe it was hitting Power Ice and that was just a dumb move. <laughs> this is true. Too bad you couldn't have used I've Signal been Beam. To do decisions like that. I cannot use Signal Beam. But. 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 I forget where I was going with this. I recall some butts being involved. you would be if they weren't. This is a darn good question. Wow. This is going to take 25 tail slaps. Oh, there's a paralysis. Yes, I was like, Anna. this is a bad idea, but I I don't really have anything I want to switch into this situation now. I wasn't expecting Cotton Guard. No. I actually battled someone a little while ago. His first Pokemon that he sent out was Ampharos. It was Max... Uh, Special attack and max special defense. And it had an assault vest. No, it was max... Yeah, no. It was max HP, max special attack. And it had an assault vest. And I knocked off his assault vest and he cotton guarded. It was it was such a bizarre... <laughs> That's a very strange story to say. I was like, did I you like know it. I was going to knock that off? And then nothing on my team could touch him after that point. It was stupid. It was quite the silly situation. I really don't want to get mock punched. 
So it's either Breloom or uh, Mr. Mime that's your technician user. I'm going to go out on a limb and say it's Breloom. I know that's an incredible thing to say. I but reveal my secrets. I'm happy I stayed in. Wow, this is not going oh, to KO. Right. Paralyzed. Right. No! Nope. Do not, um... Substituting here would be in poor taste, I would say. Mm, I think you're right. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm slower, so what I say doesn't matter here. Ah, there's the I mock punch. It would have mattered anyways. Yeah. <laughs> it was Mr. Mime the whole time. I did not expect that. I really thought it was Breloom. I almost oh, used Breloom, too. I also, uh, I was very close to choosing Persian, because Persian gets those weird coverage options for special attacking and on uh, Nasty Plot. I thought about Persian, but... Yeah. No! Wow, you're bulky. Yes, I made him a very, very bulky person. I should have leech seeded. <laughs> oh, you're that Breloom. I'm that Breloom. You're that Fortune Breloom. <laughs> <laughs> that thing was so incredibly in that Breloom literally wouldn't work in OU now because of all the the, vo the sound moves going through substitute but back then that would just wall entire tunes just... and infiltrator just so much talent for the flame yeah like when I set up this team I was just like it's really weak to fire and flying and then you killed Darmanitan on the third turn of the battle and you're like it'll be fine well it's like I don't want any, like, um, what is it, Gale Wings Peck? <laughs> that would be the most absurd Yeah, thing. that's, uh, I those are Uber technicality that. strats. That would be fun, playing Ubers with technicality. Oh <laughs> then, then we have, uh, I don't know, just something random, like, uh, how a lot of Ubers will get random coverage moves, and it's just like, yeah, use headbutt. No, wait, that's base 70 power. Uh, wow, see, this makes you think about this so differently. Crap. Does. Are you ready for something absolutely absurd? I think you're gonna like this. I don't think I'm gonna like this. Well, I mean, if you live, you'll probably get a laugh out of it. <laughs> if I feel like that's a broadly okay, applicable live, statement. If I live, you'll be amused. If you live, I'll... what? Aerialate. What? Aerialate <laughs> boosted vice grip. Fifty-five base. That's that's beautiful. That's just beautiful. I was like, mm, does he get tackled? No. <laughs> he gets vice grip. Well, since you use your mega, I'll bring in mine at this point then. Just because. Oh, guess what else? You're also not going to like this. I hope it's not faint. Okay, good. <laughs> I just I thought about faint as soon as I clicked protect and I was like, that's a thing. I do have faint. I should have used it there. It's like he's a sharpedo. Mm. Nah. Nah. Sharpedo oh. was actually what made me ask, and I used non-attacking moves because I was like, I really want to use something with strong jaw. Uh, and I almost used Tyrantrum, but then I was like, he has a lot of weaknesses. Let's not do that. Down to the wire. Yeah, this has actually been a pretty um, pretty close match. Unfortunately, I can't. Um... I think this is where it goes awry for me. Although I would have loved to show you what kind of bag the tricks I had had on Mr. Mime. No. Wow. Yes. Really? How bulky did you make that dang thing? Granted, Aqua Jet is really weak. But still. Okay, here we go. Adaptability boosted. Wait, do I want to do that? No. No, I don't want to do that. We need to save that for Mr. Mime, just in case. We're going to do this. This is a sure hit move. Shockwave cannot miss. Oh yeah. Okay, it's down to the last two. Here comes Mr. Mime. And I'm wondering... Let's see. Mr. Mime technician boosted moves. Psywave... Could be technician boosted. I don't remember sideways mechanics anymore. Uh, 
side wave is like a variable, and so I just sort of avoided those altogether. Ah, but I know it gets water one poles. Thing, one thing that I did use, which I actually really like, and I think you'll be at least entertained by. What? No, oh. dang, that didn't kill? Seriously? That was normal gem boosted and adaptability and... That was the hyper beam of... It has actually a surprisingly high special defense. That's True. Just the one he stands out in. But this is a scarfed copycat Mr. Mime. Oh. A technician. So I'm basically using everything you're going to throw at me against you. I'm just going to keep on clicking I was swift. actually really proud of this. Ooh, that clutch live. Oh, so close. That was actually that a pretty was... good batch. That was a lot of fun. That was I'm one to be, to be proud of. I have Recycle on <laughs> Porygon Z so I can recycle the normal gym. That, 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 I feel good about that match. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Glad I suggested this. This was a lot of fun. Hopefully so now we have, we have two battle types now that we can go back to from now on. Technicality and Mega Mystery. So. Exactly. We need to start doing these more regularly. Yes, I believe so. Yes, please. All right. And I need to figure out some other random things. But yeah, yeah. three losing streak. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if we keep on rolling. Five, five percent. I probably could have had you if I used confusion instead. But where's the fun in that? Yeah, then I wouldn't have known about the copycat. Copycat was just. You know what? I may have lost the match to show you copycat, but it was just... I love it too much. I was so proud of that. It was uh, was that a moral victory, as they call it? That was, a, that was a moral victory, because everything would be technician boosted. He had to technician. I was throwing your own stuff against you. I was so proud. But that 40 HP is not helpful. No. Even with that high special defense. Uh, at least I. I'm still waiting on a Mr. Mime evolution of some sort, where he's, uh, instead of a mime, I guess he'd be a, I don't know, a clown? I don't know. Um, they give him a unicycle. They just give Mr. Mime a unicycle. <laughs> That's the mega evolution. We'll make him one of the fancy clowns where they just wear the tuxedo. <laughs> I feel like the words fancy clown are a bit of an oxymoron. Maybe? I mean, mm. it could be like an expensive pie that they shove in people's faces. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. And on that note, I'm going to end this recording. Um, guys, if you want to follow uh, Guy online on Twitter, his Twitter is... Astro Ragtime. It's awesome. the nickname that I used. You can see it over my little... Youngster head. Yeah, that I'm gonna swirl my mouse around it for emphasis. Okay, so guys, <laughs> if you enjoyed the the battle, just be sure to leave a like. Uh, if you have any other weird ideas for types of battles, or if you want to do a technicality match with me or guy, just let us know. I'm on Twitter too, as you all know. So we will talk to you next time. Guys, say goodbye. Cheers, gents. Later, guys. <laughs>